Hi guys. Let's see. So, this gigantic, beautiful box. There she is. Hi, Danny. Okay. So, hi, Sarah. So, this beautiful box is from my wonderful friend, Danny. Me, Kimmy, and Danny are doing a spring, like, box swap. And this is from Danny. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay. Ah! Oh. <laughs> okay, girl. This thing is freaking packed. <laughs> I'm sorry. Like, I'm running off of Snickers Brownie right now. So. <laughs> Hi, Kimmy. Okay, so. I have no idea what's in here. But it already is so beautiful. So, there's a lot of stuff in here, you guys. So, I don't know how long this is going to take. <laughs> Holy moly. Oh, my gosh. Okay, well, let's start with this beautiful bag right here. And my phone is... I fully anticipate everything to be smashed. Everything looks perfect. Nothing looks smashed. And it was, like, taped so well. Okay, so I've never had Old Bay seasoning. And I guess it's like super common, at least in Maryland or the East Coast. I know it's around here, but it's like not something that's traditionally used here on the West Coast. I am so excited. This is going to be so good. I'm going to try and figure out um, what... Oh, I want to smell it. Mm, should I open it? Should I open it? I'm going to open it and smell it. I'm a freaking weirdo. Because... Yes, I need to. I want to make something tonight. Mmm. Oh, it smells so good. Yummy. Yes, send me recipes. Okay, I'm so, so, so excited. That would be so good on chicken. I didn't thaw any chicken out. And then she gave me this big Skittles, which I need to snack on because I'm, like, having low blood sugar. And a Twizzlers and a Chupa Chup. That is so sweet, Danny. Seriously, that makes me smile. <laughs> do a finger dab? Okay, I'll do a finger dab. Like a pinky dab. Oh, shit. I already made a mess. I already made a mess because I opened it. Let's see. Mmm. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, it's kind of spicy. Has a little bit of a kick to it. Ooh. Mmm. What does that remind me of? I guess kind of like a seasoning salt. Ooh, yummy. That is super good. I apologize if I miss any comments. Um, because my stupid tripod, so I'm going to try and keep up, but you, you are, you are Caucasian. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> I love spicy stuff. Okay. Looks like we have a lot of love fat wax in here, which is amazing. I'm so excited to try them. I haven't actually tried them yet. I placed, um, an order, but I haven't gotten it. So let's go through these. The first one is in Blonde Moment. Mmm, that is such a delicious scent. That smells like there's raspberry or something in there. Oh, such a really fresh, like, refreshing, fruity scent. Should I, like, pull it? There, that's probably a good angle, right? Okay, we have Marshmallow Bomb, Captain Crunch Berries, and Vanilla Buttercream. Girl, I just want to say thank you so much. Like, this box is so... It's packed so full. Like, you went above and beyond for sure. Ooh, yummy. Okay, so I love that the Captain Crunch Berries isn't, like, super, super strong. Like, it's there, but the marshmallow. Mmm. Oh, I want to put some of this in my melting basket this week. Hi, Bernice. Aw. Like, you seriously spent so much time putting our boxes together I just, I'm, I'm beyond words. I don't even know. We have, um, stuffed animals, which is cotton candy frosting, birthday cake, frosted animal cookies. Yum. That writing is so tiny. Mmm. <laughs> I don't know if I've smelled one, like, quite like this. It definitely smells different. Um, than a lot of other cotton candy scents I've tried, but I have been loving cotton candy. Danny is seriously the sweetest freaking person ever. Like, 
We were so excited for my box to finally have got here. I, I thought it wasn't going to make it today. Okay, we have creamy cream cream noel vanilla sugar waffle cone mexican fried ice cream and i'm sorry if i go through these quickly i'm just like i said i'm just like running off candy Ooh, that smells good i got more waffle cone i thought i was gonna get maybe like some type of cinnamon note in there but it actually smells kind of like fried ice cream like a fried waffle cone with ice cream oh you kind of yeah that fried note is definitely there you're the nicest mean person. Okay. No, you're not. You are not mean at all. Okay, we have marshmallow fluff peanut butter cookies chocolate fudge. I will be interested to see about this peanut butter cookies. Hey, Anna. Oh, maybe I should get a pillow. My back is spasming. Hi, Veronica. So this is from um, Danny. This is our spring swap box. Ooh, the peanut butter in here is actually really pleasant. I am very surprised. It actually smells like a peanut butter fudge that we get every year from Apple Hill. Um, we go do that like in the fall time. This smells so good. So yummy. Oh my gosh, there's so many in here. This one is blueberry pumpkin patch zucchini bread 7-up pound cake. That one sounds super interesting. Um, let's see. Hi, Ashley. I know I got some fat wax. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, so blueberry pumpkin. Ooh, I def definitely get a little bit of, this one's so good. Okay, hold on. Okay, I think I really like the addition of the 7-Up Pound Cake in here. It, like, makes it super, like, refreshing and not, like, I don't know, super cloying how sometimes zucchini bread can be that is really really good I know I can't wait I need to send I still have to send Danny's and Kimmy's box out I just I've been procrastinating <laughs> I've never been able to get any now I'm on a low buy so shoot very sweet of her yes she is incredibly sweet hold on guys I need to get a pillow because I'm freaking old and my back is already killing me let me get some support here hold on Okay. Oh, shoot. My stupid phone. Okay. Did I miss anything? No. Okay. Let's keep going. We have Christmas tree. This is Marshmallow Fireside in Winter Wonderland. Is Winter Wonderland a Bath and Body Works type? Ooh, this is like... This reminds me of... It's kind of menthol-y. Wow, that is really interesting. I like it, but I, I'm not exactly sure what I'm smelling. Maybe it's... Maybe it's eucalyptus? I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh my gosh, we have pink sugar spearmint lavender vanilla. Okay, this is like definitely a way to my heart. Oh, it's really light. This one smells mostly of like a spearmint. It's definitely up my alley. I love spearmint. I'm so excited I get to try all of these. We have honey pear cider, which I don't think I've tried it all before. Ooh, very juicy and almost like clean and crisp. Yum, that one's super good. What are you vomiting about? <laughs> Which one? The spearmint? <laughs> we have Christmas tree, marshmallow, fireside, winter wonderland. So this one's almost the same as the other one, huh? Oh, no, this is two of them. Sorry, I missed the one, the Christmas tree at the top the last time. Yeah, this is two of the same one. Christmas tree. Yeah, I, that's a very interesting scent. So I will be... Excited to see how that one turns out in the warmer. Okay, one more Love Fat Wax here on the top. And this is, let me read it because it's so small. The Lorne Fresh Roasted Coffee Vanilla Hazelnut Fudge Brownie. Ooh, yummy. <laughs> that sounds delicious. 
Mmm, that one is good. You definitely get the, I guess, the hazelnut in there. It has this, like, kind of, like, nutty tone to it. It's not, like, bitter. And the fudge brownie is definitely there. You have to, like, chocolate. Mmm, it smells kind of just like a really chocolatey brownie with, like, nuts. That's really good. Okay, let's see. We have some sassy wax on the top here, too. And this cute little tile or a little tart. This is Nature Walk. Strawberry Pine, Sweet Rocky Pine, and Sugared Spruce. I am so happy you sent this to me because I love this scent. I had a brittle and I used the whole thing and I loved it. It was so good. It was so original. Like nobody has anything like that. I thought it was delicious and yes, I did melt it. <laughs> I thought it was totally springtime appropriate. Hi Angie. Okay. Oh my gosh. What to next? Another sassy wax. This is cute. My favorite color is pink. Pink chiffon, pink sands, and pink sugar. Ooh. I think I may have gotten a sample of this, but I'm so excited to try this one. Ooh, this is very pretty. This seems like very feminine, kind of beachy. Ooh, that's very nice. I like that a lot. You knew I would like that. <laughs> I feel like Danny definitely knows me. Okay, Night Owl. This is a vendor I've never tried before, and this is in Buttermint Candies. Oh, yum. Oh, yes. Oh, I love Buttermint. Oh, yummy. That one's so good. It's a very pretty girly scent. Yes. I am all for that. <laughs> That's so good. Okay, what? Which, which one next? This one? Ooh, sassy, you sent me Sassy Girl Aroma. Okay, this is Lots of Love, Sweet Lavender, Watermelon, Cantaloupe, Chamomile, and Light Floral. Ooh, I don't have anything like this. I definitely don't have a lavender melon scent, so let's see. Oh, it's pretty. You definitely get this, like, kind of, like, musky floral in the background. It's predominantly... A very like fresh floral scent. I'm not getting much lavender. It's really pretty. Definitely a springtime scent for me. Okay. Oh, you said <laughs> I wanted to buy more Simo too, and I just haven't. So these are Simo wax melts in sweet lavender pink chiffon. Look how cute these are. I wish the melon was stronger. Yeah, I didn't really get any melon, but I'm wondering maybe it'll come through. Maybe it'll become, like, sweeter and juicier. Look how cute. Oh, my gosh. These are adorable. Oh, I love this. The lavender isn't, like, super pungent. And the pink chiffon kind of adds just, like, this little sweet berry note to it. Ooh, yummy. That one's really pretty. It's kind of, like, on the lighter side, but that's, like, the perfect nighttime melt. Because I have a warmer right next to my bedside. Like, it's literally, like, a foot and a half away from me. <laughs> so sometimes it's nice to have something that's kind of, like, on the lighter side that I can just kind of drift off to sleep to. Okay, I'm so excited and so pumped. Waxy taffy. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Feeling zen. Um, this is sweet peppermint and hints of earthy eucalyptus. This is so fun. Okay, I tried to smell it in the bag, but I think I'm going to have to unwrap one of these, like, little candies. It makes me want to eat it, though. <laughs> Ooh. This reminds me of, like, a... Like a shop. Like a, um... We have a place here called Tribal Weaver... And it smells kind of like that shock to me. It is definitely more of like an earthy scent. That is really unique. I didn't think it was going to be that unique. The eucalyptus is definitely different than other eucalyptus I've smelled. Oh my goodness. Stop it, phone. Okay, I just want to make sure I was at the bottom of the comments. <laughs> okay. Broadway. Oh, oh my gosh, look at that. It's like a little tiered cake. This one's in seawood, black sugar, sea salt, lotus blossom, peach magnolia, raspberry, and bamboo and teak. Wow. I don't think I ever saw this one being offered. 
Ooh. This is a very, like, light, bleached kind of wood scent. There's a little bit of sweetness and a little hint of, like, fruitiness in the background that makes it so pretty. This is not masculine to me, like, at all. This is such a pretty scent. I love that. that and that cake is so cute. I would totally take all of these out of their packaging, but you guys, we would be here forever. <laughs> Oh, she sent me this. I think she got this in her mystery box. This is Santal smoked vanilla. I thought this sounded so good. Um, I don't think I've had either of these scents before from L3. I felt like it was a pretty delicate aquatic scent. Yes. It's very delicate. That's a great word to describe it. Ooh. Oh my God. This is freaking delicious. I love this. <clears throat> I seriously love this. I think the Santal is adding like this powdery, like woody kind of aspect to it, but it's not overly woody. That vanilla is so, so good. Oh, you didn't like this one, huh? Oh my gosh. Yes, that one is so good. It's not overly smoky at all. Yum. I love it. It's like a toasted vanilla more than smoky to me. <laughs> is this my custom? Did you make this custom? This is from Bodies Harmony, Vanilla Lace, Salty Sea Air, and Toasted Marshmallow. This sounds freaking phenomenal. Okay, I'm so excited for this. <laughs> These are like all three like favorites of mine. Oh my god, it's so good, you guys. I'm pretty sure this is a custom. Yes, it's one of my customs. You know me so well. <laughs> this smells so good, you guys. Oh my gosh, I could see I could sit and huff this bag. This is perfect, Danny. Seriously, this you did such a good job. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. I feel I feel so special. <laughs> yeah, I know her emoji reactions. She does not like hide her emotions, which is fantastic. <laughs> Cuz I can always rely on her for an honest answer. <laughs> Okay, another love fat wax, and this is cotton candy, maraschino cherry, and fizzy pop. This sounds delicious. Oh my god. Yes, this smells like a cherry lime drink. But like a really like, like maybe like a kid kind of like extra sweetened drink. Oh my gosh, I want to melt that right now. Sorry if you hear my phone going off. There's like a group text message going on between my family right now um, <clears throat> for my grandpa. So if you keep hearing dinging, I apologize. Um, we have Love Fat Wax in Pink Sugar Spearmint Lavender Vanilla. Did I get this one? Yes. You sent me two. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Yay. Okay, another waxy taffy. This is so cute. Snappy taffy. So this is the scent winter, which is white woods, pine needles, sparkling clementine, and hints of clove, which is a bath and body works type. Oh yeah. I love, I love winter. I love all the snow day, the winter, like all those like fresh, crisp, outdoorsy scents mixed with like pine and tree. Oh yeah. That's totally me. I love it. Thank you for sending me the duplicates. <laughs> that way I can put them like in multiple warmers throughout my whole house. I love that. Okay. Oh, see, I totally missed out on this one. I'm so happy you sent it to me. This is Work Bitch from Wandering in Wonderland. And this is strawberry daiquiri blended with whipped cream. And this sounds so good. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. I love Brittany. Okay, let me open. Okay, so it's like a declammed clam shell. Look how cute, you guys. It has like little hearts. Ooh, that is good. Okay, it's strawberry daiquiri, but this doesn't smell like a lot of other strawberry scents that I've smelled before. This is amazing. I think it's the whipped cream that's really helping like add like this fluffiness to it, but this is... I have not smelled like this type of strawberry before. This is really, really yummy. I thought it was going to be different, but this is way better than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> this is yummy. Oh my gosh, I'm so, I'm so happy I have all this fun wax to try. Especially Wandering in Wonderland, because I've only made 
I think maybe one or two purchases from them. So that's very exciting. <laughs> Yay. Oh my gosh. This thing is just stuffed, you guys. Okay. This looks beautiful. Let's see what this is. Oh my gosh. Look, it's like a witch on a broomstick. Okay, this is from Britta's. Oh, yay. Okay, this is Attack of the Jam Jack o' Lanterns, which is Sour Patch Kids, Gummy Bear, Slushy, and Blue Raspberry. That sounds divine. That sounds delicious. Ooh, yummy. Okay, this definitely smells like, like gummy candies. Ooh, what am I picking up the most? I don't know if I'm specifically getting Blue Raspberry, am I? I don't know, like a con like a concoction of fruit, but it's definitely not fruit punchy. It has that kind of like more lemon limey kind of scent. That one's yummy. That shape is so cute too. Okay. Ooh, another chunky. So this one is L3's Steel Sugar and Dr. Peppermint. I've had, I have one called Dr. Ooze. Is that similar? I don't know. Oh my God, this is so good. This is delicious. It's super minty with like a hint of like more masculine notes in there, but mostly mint. And this is, I love this. Oh my gosh, Danny, I'm so happy I could take it off your hands. <laughs> he will be so loved. You have no idea. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I saw this one on your live and I was like, oh my God, I want that. Vanilla Bean Noel, Spearmint, and Lime. I was like, what does that smell like? <laughs> oh my gosh. You are freaking hilarious. <gasps> this is my new baby. Lime and Spearmint together is freaking divine. I need, I need a loaf of this. Ass. <laughs> Me or the wax? <laughs> oh my god, that one's so good. Okay. Try not to spend a million years on each one. Okay. <clears throat> this one I think will be okay. It's a tropical fruit punch. And it's called Annette's Beach Party Punch from Vintage Chic Scents. I don't like regular fruit punch. But I think because this is tropical, it'll be just fine. Because I love like pineapples and melons and mangoes and all that good stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is delicious. Mmm, it smells super pineapple-y to me. But, like, also... Oh, what is that? It might be peachy. I don't know. That smells yummy. Like, I want to drink it. The wax. Oh, okay. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yay. Oh. I am so, so happy. Okay, she got me Cypress Ridge lipstick and leopard print, which was ice cherries, pink Moscato, and velvet sugar. And I'm pretty sure she's like, pick something. And I was like, no. And she's like, you better do it or I'm going to pick something you don't like. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> I'm like, twist my arm. <laughs> yeah, pineapple juice. Yeah. Really good. Ooh, this is really good. Okay, so you definitely, definitely get a cherry scent. But it does smell like ice cherries. That is so bizarre. It smells like really fresh nose clearing, like that kind of sensation. Cherries. It's super sweet. I think the pink Moscato is also adding that like bright, like crispness to it. Yes, you pick or else you get ass wax. Pretty much. <laughs> like I had no choice. <laughs> oh, okay. Kimmy was raving about this one, and I don't think I got it. I think um, I put my last order in, and I forgot to get it. So I'm so happy to try it. This is Summer Scoop Lee's Ice Cream Parlor Red Velvet Cake and Whipped Cream. Oh, I can see why she really likes it. Yes. Oh, it's really um, soft wax. Oh, yes. That Summer Scoop is really, really nice. I don't know if I'm picking up on red velvet cake, but definitely ice cream and strawberries and whipped cream. That is super delicious. Okay. Oh, this sounds so interesting. Beach Nights and Frosty's Freeze from L3. 
This sounds super interesting because I've been very into the Beach Nights. Mixed with Frosty's Freeze. Let's see. Okay, yep, I like it. <laughs> it's not hard to please me. Mmm, this is like a salty, like, sweet treat, like, mixed with, like, almost like a creme de menthe or, like, a minty ice cream. Yep, I feel like I'm on the beach roasting marshmallows while simultaneously drinking a mint shake. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're hilarious. Okay, we have, oh, yay, more. Okay, I think I've only tried one other lovely thing, possibly, and this one is in Caribbean Beach. Um, I don't know what the set notes are, but this looks beautiful. Ooh, I feel like I'm getting some pineapple. Yeah, I'm getting pineapple, but it's very fresh. There's something creamy in here, too. I don't know if maybe it's like a coconut cream. There's something else in here, like maybe a vanilla bean Noel or vanilla lace or something. Yum. Okay, I seriously have loved every single thing you've given me. Like, there's nothing I'm like, oh, that's gross. <laughs> I think it's pineapple, coconut, and palm leaf. Okay, so the palm leaf is definitely adding that, like, extra freshness. So that makes sense. Okay, Brita's again. I'm so happy. I'm so excited. This is Crowley, which is champagne toast, margarita, strawberry, and blackberry. Yes, this sounds absolutely delicious. Okay, this is different than anything I've tried. I think it's her margarita. I think it's the margarita. It's very lime. It smells like a lime slushy. Oh my gosh, this is like addictive. Is it the, sh the added strawberry in there? I think that's what I'm really liking. It smells like a minty lime margarita with strawberry. And like an extra zang from the champagne toast. Oh, you guys, that is delicious. Okay, I need to keep my eyes out for that one because I think I'm going to fall head over heels for that. <clears throat> I can't believe how much you fit in this box. Like, this is insane. I love, uh, I love her margarita because it's less alcohol, more like lime. Oh, more lime. Yep. That's exactly what I got from it. It doesn't smell overly boozy. Okay. You seriously sent me a souffle. Oh my gosh. Okay. Twice as twisted from Britta's. Fruit Loops, tea and cakes, cotton candy frosting. Okay. Yep. I'm here for it. <laughs> Okay, see, I think I've fallen in love with tea and cakes. Look at this beautiful color. Tea and cakes is such a beautiful, sweet scent. I seriously love it. I always describe it as, like, a very, like, a yellow pound cake, like, drenched in, like, a concentrated, like, syrup or something. Mm -hmm. And the Fruit Loops really does help. That is delicious. Take it out. It took me three hours tried to pack it. Wait, take what out? <laughs> I'm so confused. It's layered. Oh, the souffle. Like, I did take it out. <laughs> oh, is it layered? Like the bottom is a different scent? <sighs> I'm getting mainly tea and cakes, but that is freaking gorgeous. Holy moly. Wow, she did four layers. That's a lot. That's a lot of layers for a little souffle. I love that. Thank you, Danny. I'm probably going to say thank you a hundred more times. I apologize, but seriously, I'm super grateful to have you as a friend and that we can do this with each other. Okay, Britta's in Monster Breakfast. Fruit Loops, Strawberry, Blackberry. That sounds really good. Is this one layered too? I'm going to take it out just in case. Ooh, this one's good. I don't know what it is. It's either, I think it might be her strawberry or maybe it is her blackberry. But I am digging her oil. It's, I, maybe it's the blackberry. That blackberry is very different and super delicious. Um, let's see. Oh my gosh, it's such a fun surprise. I think it might be her blackberry. It's really good. Okay, so anything with blackberry from Britta's is like definitely add to cart. <laughs> 
Britta's is just amazing. Okay, I cannot wait to get my pre-order. I feel like some people have gotten shipping. I think Jennifer said she got shipping. Is that true? I have, I haven't, I don't, have I gotten my shipping? I don't know. I have to look. <clears throat> okay, L3's snooze button. I love snooze button. It's such a creamy, like, vanilla, like, I don't know if it's peppermint or spearmint. I think it might be peppermint. It is so good. I love snooze button. You haven't? Okay. Well, I glad, I'm glad I'm not the only one then. Okay. Let's see. My goodness. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Okay. We have another lovely. I love these um, labels. These are super cute. Laundry room. Snuggle, dryer sheets, clean cotton, and Palo Santo. Okay, I love clean cotton. Never had Palo Santo mixed with a laundry scent before, so this should be really interesting. Did you not like this? <laughs> oh, the snooze button. <laughs> oh, I am actually pleasantly surprised. Seriously, are you kidding me? Look how freaking gorgeous this is. Lovely bath and wax. This is so much better than I thought it was going to be. Her Palo Santo is definitely leaning more cologne, which is why it works, I think, in this blend. And I definitely smell clean cotton in here. I love clean cotton. This is really unique. I really like this. Thank you so much for sending that to me. Because I, I'm i very interested to try, like, all these new fun blends that I've never tried before. Oh, I can't. How, I want to open it. Should I? I'll just rebag it. I'll rebag it when I'm done. Okay, this is Lunadora, right? No, this is Bella's Cactus. No, wait, Lunadora. <laughs> yeah, Lunadora in Bella's Cactus, which is Cactus Flower and Jade. That sounds great. Okay, so I'm going to have to... Kind of. Should I just cut it? I'm going to cut it so I don't ruin the label. Is that the best method here? I think it's the best method because I'm just going to rebag it. Yes, Lunadora does have new packaging now, so guys, don't be concerned about this packaging. This is her old packaging. I'm going to cut her open. Oh my gosh, there's little cactus flowers on the top. There's little cactus flowers. This smells really fresh and very green, almost like green grass. I think it might be the jade, too. Look how stinking cute. Okay, there's a hair. Sorry, might be my dog's hair. Let's see. This is freaking gorgeous. I love this. This is definitely springtime. This smells like like sappy, like grass, like aloe. This is beautiful. It's very strong. Uh-oh. <laughs> I definitely will need to get another bag to help save the scent. Okay. She's going to go right next to me. So, oh, well, I'll put her in the back. I don't want her to get hurt. Okay. She's going to get rebagged. Don't worry. Okay, you got me another custom. I'm so excited. Okay, this is from Bodies Harmony, and this is Cactus Blossom, Green Apple, and Jasmine. Oh my gosh, this sounds so good. I don't think I've ever thought of this blend before. This is a really unique blend. Oh my gosh. This is freaking delicious. I love that you added green apple in here. The green apple just adds this, like, fresh crispness to it, and the jasmine... I love, like, that heady white floral jasmine, but this is, like, nice and toned down and super sweet and fresh from the cactus blossom. This is, this is really good. You did an incredible job picking out scents. I'm not even joking. Danny, this is so good. <laughs> yeah, I would, I would have a hard time giving that to you if I made that. <laughs> Okay, so, moving on. <clears throat> Ooh, another L3 chunk, and this is Buttermint, Vanilla Bean Noel, and Blueberries and Cream. I think I got one that was similar to this, but this one's, I think, different. Yeah, this is, this is such a unique scent. 
I'm so interested to see how the blueberry and buttermint go together, like, in the warmer. Oh, good. Well, I'm glad because I seriously need a loaf in this, and I haven't even melted it yet. I'm so happy you got yourself some. <laughs> yeah, next time she opens customs. Is she opening customs soon? I feel like I saw something. There's something coming up, right? Because I need more. Just throw it away. No. <laughs> We have another sassy wax in this cute little, like, fluted tart in a little birdhouse. And this is blissful. Green apples, red berries, and crackling birch. I have really found my love for green apples. May. Okay. Bodies Harmony is doing a custom in May. Oh, wow. This is so good. This reminds me of something, and I really can't pinpoint what it is. It's something nostalgic. I don't know. This is green apples, red berries, crackling birch. I don't know, but this is reminding me of home. Okay, you know what this smells more like? This smells like like a green apple cider or something. Like a hot apple cider with like cinnamon sticks in it. But the green apples adding this like extra freshness and juiciness. Oh my gosh, that is really yummy. <clears throat> it doesn't smell like super iconic fall, though. I don't know if that makes any sense at all. <gasps> okay, I've fallen in love with sugared shortbread. <laughs> I can't remember what blend I got, and it had sugared shortbread in it, and I fell head over heels. And it has spearmint in it. <laughs> I feel like those two are just going to be hand in hand. Oh my god, that is so freaking delicious. This is so yummy. Oh my God. Thank you so much. <laughs> I cannot wait to melt everything. Okay. We got another chunky in here. In Butterman's Lavender Birthday Cake. Ooh, I don't know if I've had lavender and birthday cake together. Mmm, this is good. Mostly you get buttermints and like a buttercream. That is super yummy. Oh, I've been wanting to try this one. This is Rose Girls Lavender Vanilla and Summer Breeze. Gag me. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow, this is beautiful. This smells like a lavender laundry. But like super fresh, but definitely laundry, like leaning laundry. This is this is really pretty very pretty. I can definitely see myself melting that on like a nice warm spring day. Okay, we've got some more chunkies over here. Lavender honeydew creamsicle cuppy cake. Okay, I'm worried. Is the creamsicle orange? You don't know. Do you know how hard it is to buy and smell scents that you hate? <laughs> no. <laughs> Oh my god, I don't know. <laughs> You're like, oh, that's disgusting. She'll love it. <laughs> oh my god, I'm dying. <laughs> okay, let's see if this smells like orange or not. No, this is beautiful. This is absolutely beautiful. I don't know if I smell honeydew. Okay, no, I do get a little bit of honeydew in here. This is like a very, very sweet sugary crystal vanilla cake lavender. Oh, that is really good. I love that. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> this makes me want to vomit. <laughs> I think she'll love it. <laughs> okay. Okay, also another company I haven't tried. Oh, I'm going to say this wrong. This is Golden Hour Wax Co. in Saguaro Blossom. Jasmine, lavender, and floral, bergamot, and long-lasting sweet vanilla and musky. This sounds really good. This is really pretty. Look at that. Okay, I'm going to take it out. It's a very light scent. This is so pretty. Okay, wait. What am I smelling? I don't know if I'm getting lavender, but I'm definitely getting like a floral bergamot. This is gorgeous. Okay, I need more of this. That is so pretty. Saguaro Blossom. 
Oh my gosh, this is so good. All of these, I don't know, whatever this concoction is, is freaking amazing. Okay, you're not going to be able to see everything because I've got a huge pile going. Oh, yay. Okay, really? Sorry, this bothers me. I'll take that out. <laughs> this I really wanted to try because I love trying everybody's lavender soda and I have never tried the bathing gardens lavender soda. So this is fizzing lavender soda. And this is freaking gorgeous. Like, holy moly, look at that. Okay, I'm so excited to try that golden hour wax now. Hey, Hannah. Ooh, this is pretty. This is soft. And the lime is, or the, the soda, or whatever you want to call it, is not taking over. This is really pretty. I don't know if I smell la or lavender exactly. This is really pretty. Um, that is, like, very delicate. Is this the package you just said was lost yesterday? No. No, that package is still lost. I don't know if that package will ever make it to me. So, <laughs> my USPS just keeps messaging me back after I send lost package inquiry saying, sorry. <laughs> I'm like, what do you mean? <laughs> like, you're not going to look for it? Like, I don't understand. No, this is from my friend Danny. We are doing a spring swap box, but it's like she fit three swap boxes into one box, so <laughs> I don't know. This is crazy. I know. Okay, we have Slumberland from L3. I have not tried this one. This smells like maybe honey lavender gelato. There's something really sweet in here, like honey. Mm, I think I'm going to like that. I'm not sure. If it's honey, lavender, gelato, I've had some weird experiences in the past. Okay. Oh, here's another honey, lavender, gelato in Boom Boom. So let's see about this one. If I don't like this one, I have a really good friend that I can send this to, and I think she would love it. So let's see if I like it. It smells really good. It's like, it's got like this fruity aspect almost to it. I think I'll definitely try a chunk of it and see. I think the Boom Boom is helping like mellow it out a little bit and kind of like cream it up. So we will see. This smells really good on cold. Just sometimes when you put things in the warmer, it just like doesn't vibe with you. So we will see. I think that's like maybe the only one so far that I'm like on the fence with. Okay, some more Broadway. These are really cute, like, little breakaway bars. This is in Come Alive. Breathe Easy, Twisted Peppermint, Wintergreen, and Buttermint Candies. Okay, I remember us talking about this one, Danny. You are like, yeah, that's all you. <laughs> I, I will try a chunk of it, Danny. Like, I'm not one to just be like, nope, unless it's, like, grotesque. This is so good. This smells like gum. And I love it. Like, I know everybody says, like, wintergreen smells like gum, but it's like, this concoction actually smells like gum. And I think I'm here for it. This is so good. This is definitely, like, a nighttime blend for me. This helps relax me so much. It smells like a cough drop? Oh, no. No, 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 no. That smells like peaceful, like, rest. <laughs> oh, there's stuff that's wrapped down here. What is this? Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, this is... A brittle from Sassy Girl Aroma in Sleep Tight, which is lavender, chamomile, and vanilla bean Noel. And I cannot wait. Oh my gosh. I have like no Sassy Girl Aroma. I've never purchased from them. Ooh, this is very creamy. The vanilla bean Noel is actually pretty heavy in here, which I love. Oh, the lavender is so pretty. I love this. Oh, it's not an herbal lavender at all. Not to my nose. It comes off very sweet. I like that she's like very heavy handed with the vanilla bean Noel in there. Oh, it's okay. I don't care. No, it is beautiful. Thank you so much. Like that is, you are so kind. This is overwhelming. <laughs> like, I can't believe, first of all, that you fit all of this in there. Oh, this must be a custom loaf from Sassy Wax. I'm assuming. This is so cute. 
I love the little clouds and stars. I want you to get to your customs, to your last custom. Is this a custom? I think so. Oh, maybe. Lullaby of Dreams. Blueberries and lavender and sugar milk. Okay, I have not tried this one, I don't think. The wrap stuff is customs. Oh, okay, so. Oh, yes. I love blueberries and lavender together. This is so good. And, <clears throat> excuse me, the sugar milk is not, like, overwhelming. It just adds, like, a really nice creamy sweetness. Mm, this is so good. I love this, Danny. Look how, like, beautiful this custom is, too. You are so sweet. Thank you so much. Like, you just know me so well. You literally picked everything, and it's just been, like, totally me. Totally me. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Um, holy moly. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Like, what is this? What? Okay, hold on, guys. I'm going to cut it with scissors so I don't ruin it somehow. Oh, I almost cut my finger off. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> I would still continue, even if I was bleeding. <laughs> okay. This is gigantic. Holy cannoli. Are you serious? Oh my gosh. Okay, this is from Made to Melt, which I've never tried before, in blackberry sugared violets and sweet on Paris. Okay, seriously, I feel like there was some vendor that had this mix and I wanted it so bad because sweet on Paris I have fallen in love with after Danny actually sent me something that had Sweet in Paris on it, in it, and Blackberry Sugared Violets, I have seriously fallen in love with. Okay, we have to take this out and obviously smell it. Let's see. Oh, it's so pretty. It's so, I love Blackberry Sugared Violets because it's so feminine and, um, oh my God, this thing is freaking huge. This is ginormous. I've never seen anything like this. The Sweet on Paris makes it so, like, sweet and creamy and delicious. I love this blend. I love this. Danny. <laughs> Thank you so much. This is so, so sweet. I... You couldn't have picked better scents for me, honestly. I love this. Thank you. Oh my gosh. I almost want to put her up on a freaking shelf and like display her. <laughs> that is so pretty. Oh, I love it. I feel like I just want to melt that like the entire week. <laughs> like I don't think I could ever get sick of this scent. Like that's how, that's how pretty it is. I'm going to set her to the side because I don't want her to squish anything. And like, what is this? <laughs> What is this? <laughs> this is ginormous. Oh, you bubble wrapped her good. You bubble wrapped her good, girl. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Should I just slide her out? Okay, I'm sliding her out. <gasps> oh, my gosh. You guys. They're hot air balloons. This is so pretty. Okay, Aaron is going to love this. His grandfather actually used to race hot air balloons. And I think he is going to think this is like the cutest thing. Okay, the scent in this is lavender mallow and lavender coconut milk. Okay, Danny, how do you freaking know me so well? I'm not even joking. Lavender coconut milk is one of my favorite lavender oils. And I literally just said this in a video the other day. Yes, it is freaking beautiful. Jeez. Okay, you guys, this smells incredible. I love this. Like, are you serious, Danny? This is from... Salem Soy Co., if you guys are interested, this is gorgeous. The scent you chose is freaking gorgeous. I love this. This is so good. Danny, I love you. <laughs> like, seriously, you just know me so well. You know exactly, like, what works for me. 
I'm not going to call you a stalker, but <laughs> thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Like seriously, um, that box was jammed full. Danny, I like seriously love, I want to melt it right now. Do you think, and it's so strong. This is Salem Soiko. I am so surprised how strong it was considering that it wasn't poured that long ago. Let's see. It's been curing for over a month now. You're a stalker. <laughs> Thank you so much. This is beautiful. I am so touched. Kirsten did such a good job. I have never seen hot air balloons. Like, ever. I freaking love that. Seriously, I'm going to show Erin as soon as I'm done here. Her custom loaves are intense. Yeah, I can definitely see the difference between some of her RTS items and this custom loaf because this is very strong. I love this so much. And I'm very happy to know that she has lavender coconut milk because I don't even know if I can chop this. Like, I'll chop the grass off. But, like, I love, like, all these, like, purpley blue colors that is absolutely beautiful. I told her I wanted something dreamy and whimsical and she chose hot air balloons. Well, she did a fantastic job because I'm not even kidding. I want to go on a hot air balloon ride now. <laughs> this is so pretty. I'm going to seriously smell this all night long now. You guys, I seriously have the best friends ever. I don't even know what I would be doing right now if I didn't meet Danny and Kimmy. And so many other of you guys, too. Like, I love all of you guys. Like, I feel like we all have a very special bond. And I'm so happy to know you, Danny. And thank you so much. This was so incredibly kind. And I really hope that you love your box. Um, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> you are amazing. Um, if you guys don't already follow Danny, you definitely need to. <laughs> She's incredible. All right, guys, I'm going to hop off here because I'm old and my hips are hurting and I'm sitting on the floor. <laughs> but seriously, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I know that's so annoying. Thank you. Okay. I love you and I will talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for joining and having fun unboxing this with me. I seriously loved everything. There was like only one, maybe two things that I was like on the verge of. So, all right. Thanks, guys, and have a wonderful night. I'll talk to you later. Bye.